Oh no. And so the roller coaster continues. Is the diagnosis certain? Yes, we've reached a consensus on the results. Unfortunately, like many cases of pervasive developmental disorders, this is a rather late diagnosis. Had you known when you were a child, Ms., it could have saved you a lot of trouble. Do you have any books on it? <laughs> Thump! This one is by Tony Atwood. He's one of the specialists on the subject. You can borrow it free of charge for now, just don't elope with it. Thanks, Doc. Now, are you two a couple? Unmarried and without any other current legal affiliation? Yes, I see. Well, I could give you a referral to a specialized counselor, if you wish. Is there anything unsettling in the relationship? No. And you, sir? No, it's, it's fine. Nonetheless, sir, you should also give the book a read. It'd help you understand her condition. I'd, I'd rather not. Why is that? Well, it's your call. In the meantime, there is a thing called equine therapy that might help her. See? Yep. A ranch just north of here offers it. I can contact them for you. Told you so. <laughs> Not really. We both kind of came to that conclusion, didn't we? Received note, Tony Atwood. The author of a series of books on River's condition. It's interesting how it never actually spells it out, exactly what the condition is, but... You know, if you guys look up Asperger's or Autism Spectrum Disorders, it's, you know, it's pretty self-explanatory. It's very difficult. Um, it's extremely difficult to uh, form social relationships with this kind of condition. Just because there's a general lack of awareness and inability to recognize social cues that, you know, most of us take for granted. Excuse me, could you please silence the clock? The ticking really bothers her. Oh, that's why the clocks don't make the noise. Okay. It's not that severe. I'll be okay. No problem. It's standard policy. If there's anything at all that makes you uncomfortable, just let me know. <laughs> Leaps up to the desk and turns off the clock. Thank you. Huh. I guess that explains the ones in the house. Clock ticking. Yep. Yeah, and there are often little, no pun intended, ticks like that that seem odd to a lot of people. But, I mean, have you ever sat in a room listening to a clock ticking endlessly? It's, it's pretty freaking annoying. Makes perfect sense. Just a bit longer. They'll be calling for you soon. Man, that platypus again. A stuffed toy platypus. I can't believe this piece of atrocity is dated all the way back here. Watts, will you shut up? It's not funny anymore. Looks like someone took good care of it. She's still got pretty bad taste in animals, though. Yeah, shut up. How can you not like duck-billed platypuses? They're so rare and they're so stupid looking. They're cute. Alrighty, uh, anything else? Missing one. Oh, here we go. 
And they just leap up there too, huh? <laughs> okay, so that's the memento. Uh, missing something. Can't leave. Talk to them again? Just a bit longer. They'll be calling for you soon. No. I already got that. Am I missing? Oh, the bag. A plain tawny handbag. There it is. See, I mean, y y if you pay attention, you can see the genius of the design with the story. I mean, if you don't have to make that many areas in the actual RPG maker, and if you write cleverly enough that you don't have to, it's not going to take you forever like some people, you know, like some people might think it might. Con guy's a genius. What can I say? Prepare! That's a messed up clock. Yeah, see, one of these is going to happen where I'm going to do that diagonal and it's going to screw me over, but... Since I have to do this in four moves, that tells me I pretty much have to use the diagonal. Uh, okay, yep, got it. Nine forty. I wonder if there's any significance to that time. Let's go back into the past. Whoa, what's this? Oh, he's a kid now! Oh my gosh! Psst, look! I know, I can't believe he once paid to see this crap in the theater! No, you idiot! Look, we leaped! <laughs> He's a kid now! He's so cute! Holy overcooked macaroni! The kid's in the theater all by himself! What a loser! You go to the theater by yourself all the time. That's different! No one's competent enough to match my taste. That aside, how can anyone last through this rubbish? What's the movie? <laughs> Aw, he's leaving. Way to go, Neil. And thus, this movie sucks on both physical and metaphysical levels. Q.E.D. Come on, let's go. What? Oh, right. Whoa, wait. I ain't talking to no emo teenager. He's supposed to be a teenager? He looks like he's ten. Grammar, my dear Watson. Shut up. That's not even a full sentence. Let's just go look for mementos. Seriously, though, why is he here by himself? Oh. And he's back in the theater. <laughs> I guess I shouldn't judge. I don't mind going to movies by myself. I am no loser. At least when it comes to that. What are you doing? That's the third person you've removed here. Eh, not like it's permanent. It's kind of creepy. It's like I'm erasing people from history. 
again getting stood up now that's a Kodak moment you relate well with your kin I see I'll make fun of him for that we've all been there hey I want to construct him a lady friend can we construct a lady friend for him Ava no Aww. You know that poking them out of the way like that does nothing, right? Then why complain? I mean, I guess I'm just supposed to do this to everybody? Hey, John, quit wasting time and leave him alone. Okay... I really don't know what I'm supposed to be doing here. I haven't saved in a bit. Let's do that. Zap. 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 Oh, look. This place is all empty and creepy now. I hope you're happy. I don't know what I'm... Whoa, what just happened? What's going on? Well, there's nothing here. Hate to say it, but I guess I have to nag something out of him again. All yours. At least there are no olives this time. going on oh there she is oh river you were in there this whole time I waited for you at the lobby I, th I thought you didn't come why did you leave I thought we were watching the movie together Huh? I'm the one who should ask that. What do you mean? We were watching the movie together, and then you left. We weren't watching it together? I didn't even know where you were! If you saw me in there, why didn't you come and find me? What difference does it make? We were watching the same movie in the same room. Dot, dot, dot. <laughs> What's wrong? You're so weird. Do you not want to watch the movie together anymore? Of course I do. Come on, let's head back in before it ends. Oh. These are the times I'm glad I don't use face cam. <laughs> I feel like I should make a clever remark. You feel wrong. Well, let's hope our ride's waiting for us in there. Neil, you ruin everything. Well, that's all of them. Now where's the memento? Oh. True story. I went with the movie one time with a girl who brought a stuffed animal. I can honestly relate to this game a lot. I shouldn't say that, but I can. Once again, I've only got five moves to do this, and when it's all disjunctive like that, 
That's not a word, Kronos. When it's all messed up like that, I gotta think I gotta do this. Oh, no. I'm doing the whole... Oh, I can do this. Yeah, I got it. But now I'm using the whole grid, so that's important to note. Man, it just keeps using that platypus. Ding! Activate. You know, I think this platypus is growing on me. Mostly just for convenience, but hey. Oh no, please tell me this isn't where they first met. <laughs> My heart can't take it. Come on, dude, grow some balls. Um, it's not that. Look, maybe this wasn't such a good idea. Aw, oh, sheesh. What could possibly happen? Just think about it. Worst case scenario, she says no. You strut on like nothing happened. No one will know and everyone will still think you're cool. What if she tells someone? Or yells at me? Don't be a little wuss! Or, or says yes, but really means no. Psh, quit worrying, man. Who would do that? And what if she throws an encyclopedia in my face? I don't even have a helmet. Dear Lord, I'm so not prepared for this. Dude, don't panic. Just straighten your spine and quit being a little wuss. Yeah, you tell him! Everything will be alright, just turn around. Okay. Okay, hey, hey, what are you- Shh. <clears throat> Hello. Hello? Can you hear me? Yes? Then, then why didn't you... Never mind. Uh, that's the cool platypus you got there. What are you reading? A book. About platypus? No. Oh, uh, well, I think that's great. <laughs> hey, you wanna get lighthouses? Huh? There are exactly 16 second order Fresnel lens lighthouses in the country left. Nine of them are coastal, and one of them was modified from a historic kerosene lamp lighthouse. Oh... <clears throat> Is that what you're reading about? Um, say, you, uh, you want to go catch a movie together sometime? I don't know. Well, that's that's okay. I'll uh, I'll give you time to think about it. I can't. Why? There's no date or time. Oh, um, how about this Saturday at eight? Ava, I think the system fro- Yes. Oh, great! Never mind. I guess we'll work out the details later. Um, I'll just, uh...
What? What are you looking at me for? You think I'm gonna call out how utterly awkward that was? <laughs> well, just forget it. I'm not giving in to your expectations. Give him a break. He was still just a kid. You of all people should relate. What's that supposed to mean? Shut up and go. Shut up isn't my name, you know. <laughs> what was that? Like, I know you are, but what am I? <laughs> 